And we're back with Science Bob. What have you got for us today, Bob? A good experiment. This is, uh, I think, one of my favorite new experiments. It's called Blobs in a Bottle. Okay. And what, what kid wouldn't like blobs in a bottle? So for this, all you need is a couple things. Uh, I use one liter bottles, but you can use any size. We've done this in containers as small as test tubes. Uh, regular water, cooking oil, a little food coloring, and the secret ingredient, alka seltzer. All right, so let's show you how you do this. Uh, we're going to start with our water. So we're going to go with about three quarters of a cup of water in the bottle. I'll let you do this. All right, there you go. Just pour that, that right in there. The whole thing. Whole thing, right in there. Beautiful. Excellent. You're like an expert at this. All right, then we're going to, uh, we need to do the oil. Okay. And the oil, I'm going to give you a little tip here. Use a funnel, and here's yeah. our oil here. Regular cooking oil, okay. uh, canola oil. And if you tilt this a little bit like that, yeah. then uh, it'll, it'll help it out a little bit, which you'll see in all a second. Right. So I'll hold, hold this. Okay. Yeah, we'll do a team How effort do here. Want? And we're going to go all the way to the top. All the way to the top. Okay. So uh, the parents will love the fact that the kids are using up the oil. And, and you'll Are see, of course, that the, uh, what you remember from eighth grade, that water is more dense. Okay. And so it will go down to the bottom. So it's a little mixed up here. And then eventually it will look like this. Okay. And so you can see the water more dense, the oil less dense on the top there. Yeah. Now comes the cool part. Uh, here, get that out of your way. Uh, this oh. is uh, food coloring, regular food coloring, but it's water-based. So watch what happens. You take this, yep. and let's put about eight drops in. And watch what happens as they go down here. Yeah, keep going. There, there it goes. So it's going to drop right down. It's not going to mix. And this isn't even the good part yet. So watch. There it goes. Now watch what happens when it hits the water. Give it a second. Give it a second. We're gonna... Come on, blobs. You can do it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, goodness. Come on. Uh, we'll get to it in a second. It'll work. All right. Then, for the ultimate blobs here, Alka-Seltzer. Okay. Uh, okay. So we've broken this up. And these, of course, will fizz uh, when they go in water. And that's going to help create our blob. So here, take a couple pieces of Alka-Seltzer there, drop them right in. Okay. There you go. Down they go. So they don't dissolve until they actually hit the water. And now, and here come our blobs. And that food there, the food oh coloring has kicked in. Gosh. And so we give a second, and then you'll start to see the, the coloring lift up. And it's kind of like a lava lamp. I it don't know. is. Did you have a lava lamp growing yeah, up? Yeah, yeah. And so this will go for oh quite a while, and then, isn't that nice? And then when, uh, after fin uh, it's done fizzing, mm -hmm. it will uh, just sit there, and then you just throw some more in. Uh, and of course, what's happening is the, uh, the fizz picks up a little bit of the color, that lifts it up, uh -huh. then as the fizz is released, it brings the color back down. So, I thought we'd have a little fun. I got a bunch of bottles here. Okay. Just take pieces and let's drop them in. Okay. We'll get some, uh, some of these going. <laughs> Look at this, I, 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 do you like that bottle? I love this bottle, I'm not sure it's what my that's favorite. There we go, we'll drop these in. So uh, <laughs> different colors, whatever you want there. And then again, you can just cap it. We had uh, someone on the, on the uh, website that said that they just keep it capped and then when they get bored doing their homework, what they'll do is they'll just uh, drop a drop couple tablets in. And if you really want the ultimate, I don't know if we can get our lights dimmed here. You know, if you really want it to be like a lava lamp, look at that. Oh my gosh, go. it is. Cool? It's like the uh, ultimate 60s experience brought back to life. <laughs> So uh, we have all the information on this uh, on the website so that people can do it at home.